What if I tell you that I built this automation that generates for me hundreds of dollars passively with the minimal effort? Because actually the point is here, as you can see, I've got hundreds of dollars generated with AA stock images that we can easily create with Midjourney, Leonardo AI. And the main point is we've got the problem with keywords and titles. And this entire automation allows us to create highly professional titles and keywords, actually post it, copy and paste, post it on Adobe Stock. And the best point is after you publish your images, um, you do anything. Actually here, everything is automatical. You just earn money. So in this video, I will show you how to build this entire workflow and how it works. However, before building it, let me show you the entire process, how it handles my entire images. Let's say I've got some images I want to upload to Adobe Stock. I can upload them to Google Drive. Then I can simply click on test workflow inside and I done. Afterwards, our titles and keywords are uploaded inside Google Sheets. We need to click on the file here, download and there export as CSV. In the Adobe Stock, click on the upload CSV. Then just click here, choose a file. And click on upload and within actually seconds, we've got our images that are set up here, shiny red hard balloon image. There we've got the keywords and um, there we've got ribbon, elegant pink bow, tea on um, isolated background. We've got like the title for the gift. So by this way, you can provide endless images, create instantly titles for them and keywords. And it's super, super useful because it saves you a lot of time and even you can create perfect content to earn money. Also remember, if you would like to download the entire template for this project without actually doing anything, go over to our AA Agents Accelerator to the classroom. And um, here also we've got an NIDEN course that lasts 17 hours. However, go ahead to YouTube resources. Here, click on passive income with stock images. And at the bottom, you will have the template that you need to just copy, like download and import inside the NADEN. And that's pretty everything you have afterwards this entire automation. However, now let me explain you how it works. So first things first, we've got a trigger. So whenever we click on test workflow, um, it triggers the entire um, automation, all right? Um, then we've got our node for searching um, for the specific folder inside Google. So inside what we have the resource file folder, operation search, and uh, then what we do, we return all elements we have inside. So all our images, because let's say you've got endless um, images right there. You just want to have all of them. All right. So as you can see here, I've got the ID name. Um, it's really enough. You pick here and um, you provide the filter and you pick the specific folder. Um, what you do next, you download actually images. So what you do, you um, pick the resource with, which is file, operation download, and you provide the ID from here. So we drag and drop the ID from the previous step. Afterwards, you've got three items, as you can see, it's pretty cool. Even you can view them. So yeah, we've got this ribbon, it's nice. Then it's the time for a loop over items because there is the secret sauce. We would like to use OpenAI, actually all of these steps in the loops, in the loop for all of the elements. So first things first, what we do, we provide this loop. We've got the bath, batch um, size, which is one. And then we go over with the open AI um, step. We create here the title and keywords. And let me actually show you inside. You've got a task. So create me metadata for a single image in valid JSON format Invalid the JSON format, because afterwards we would like to, um, if we have actually our keywords, we would like to turn them from array to string to use in Adobe stock. So here, JSON format, the output must be in a JSON array. And there what we have the title, perfect description for the title. Actually, we would like to specify um, between 50 and 80 characters. And um, these are the best titles for the Adobe stock. Keywords, a list of 55 keywords. Um, in Adobe Stock, we've got 49, however, it's kind of the safety net. We've got plus six keywords, so in case actually it generates the duplicates or something else. We've got the format requirements, so return a valid JSON array. And um, the keywords um, actually field must always include exactly five, uh, 55 strings and so on and so on. So we've got all of this data. Also, you can go over here um, to our community and you can copy all of the data there for your model, right? So you can just copy that. Um, you choose the input type, which is binary file, and there the input data field, which is data, and you click on simplify output. Afterwards, you should get this entire response, so title, keywords, and so on. 
Then what you do, you use actually code node because here uh, you would like to actually specify that, hey, please turn the array actually keywords in array to string and you've got all of this um, data. You can, um, you can again, kind of copy that from our community. So we've got JavaScript code. Uh, just simply go over here, copy that and paste here. After that, you've got the title and keyword separately. It's nice, it's nicely formatted. What you do next, you go over to the Google Sheets and you open the row. You pick the document, so I've got this document. Also, we can um, actually make a copy inside our community. Um, so I've got this document, all right, I pick the sheet one, map each column manually, I pick the file name. So this is the file name from loop over items. From here, you pick this name. Um, the title, you pick the title from um, code block. So here the title, you just drag and drop it here. Keywords, and even there you provide category. Because let me show you something. Even to more automate the entire process, you can pick category. So let me provide Adobe stock um, categories, categories, okay. Um, and here you've got the specific categories, animals, um, buildings, business, drinks, environment, states of mind, and so on. So you provide a specific number. Uh, also both you can actually delete it. So don't provide here the category. Um, it's your choice. Actually, I didn't provide it. So, you know, um, you can do this. So in general, you've got three fields and afterwards you provide the data here, okay? For the first item. And after you provide the data for the first item, you would like to delete an image um, inside Google Drive to tidy it up. And afterwards, after you, um, let's say you take all of the data because we would like to um, export later CSV file, uh, you wanna delete the file from the Google Drive um, and also will be deleting the data from Google Sheets um, to prepare that for further use, okay? It's really important because this file actually here, it's no longer uh, for us useful, so we can delete it. And then what we do, uh, we go over with the first item and the loop, actually the reiteration is the second. So we go over with the second item and until uh, we create a title and keywords for all of the items. After the loop is finished, what we do, we um, go over with the path, which is done. So after the, all of the loop iterations, we wait for three minutes and this is the time interval for us to actually go over here, click on file, click um, action download and CSV and take this file and upload inside um, Adobe Stock, okay? So this is the time you need to actually to um, download this file and afterwards we can clear the entire sheet. And I can say it is how it works, okay? So now even let me provide two more images to show you the entire process. So I can here upload two images. Um, let me upload two images right there. And I will show you how it exactly works. Uh, for me, it's super useful actually. I don't need to provide uh, my very own um, keywords, titles, like do all of the stuff. Um, yeah, so now what we can do, uh, we can go over and execute this entire workflow. So now as you can see, it searched for the specific folder, it downloaded the images, here we've got um, yeah, our loop, so it creates the title and keywords for the first, um, actually our image, it turned that actually the keywords for the string, and then uh, what it did, it saved the first data for the first image inside Google Sheets, and now it goes with the second, um, let's see, it should appear here, nice. We've got the file name, title, keywords, it's super cool, now it waits for three minutes. So now it's the time interval for us to click copy, download, CSV. And now after I have that, I can even upload my images right here. Let's upload them uh, very fast. And it's super useful. Like, look on that. We actually do anything. Um, all right, we've got the problem with uh, one image. So let's uh, provide the data for this one. So I can click on upload CSV. Um, choose a CSV file, and now even um, even we've got the problem with uh, one image. Have a look how it works. We'll have the data for this entire um, confident female construction worker smiling. Keywords, everything we wanted. And now imagine, you can provide, let's say, 100 images. Like, create titles and keywords for each of them. Create images and, and actually, you know, uh, multiple images in Mid Journey, Leonardo AI, and other platform. Just you have the automation for the titles and keywords 
and just earn passive income as I do. So here I've got images, I created for them um, yeah, titles, keywords, it's super, super useful. Obviously, you could have done it with, for example, let's say ChatGBT, like provide like the entire title and keyword stuff. However, for me, it's it's just better, you know, like I, I like to use automations. Um, like I need to only provide the images inside the folder and then I can just take the file and let's say I've got 100 images. I can just take the file from um, Google Sheets, export that and afterwards just upload that to the um, Adobe stock and like all of the content is created for me. It's super, super useful. For now, actually, thank you for watching. Remember to check out our AA Agents Accelerator. Inside we've got plus 110 different uh, premium AA Agents templates. We've got our 17 hours and Aiden course. We've got actually our voice, voice agents, YouTube resources. Also here you've got other, um, for example, daily news AA Agent. You've got everything here explained with the template. LinkedIn post generator. So I will put the link in the description of this video. Actually, we constantly provide um, new templates, <laughs> new content. Feel free to check it out. Um, for now, the price is really low comparing to the value inside. So again, just join or not. Thank you for watching. Remember to leave a like and a subscription uh, for the YouTube algorithm. Again, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next material.